Hear a voice. What's up, everyone? So uh, here we go. Um, basically, one thing to remember on the first round is it's six shots to the um, to the chest, and then a knife. So that'll get you 190 points each time. You can go for um, seven to the leg, but um, I like to not do that because sometimes they die. And, um, I don't know, it's just easier to do six to the chest. And when you have two lined up like that and there's one behind him, you can shoot the guy behind him one more time. It works in the pelvis too. You could do like seven to the pelvis, but I'm not going to do that. So already, after the first round, we just gained like, uh, 1,140 points. So... If you're not doing that already, then you should probably do it. So, on round two, I think it's about 12 or 13 shots to the chest. Oh, I missed. Oops. Yeah, but it, that doesn't really matter because once you run out of ammo, you're going to want to buy the M14, but not till round three. So, we're just going to knife. Because at round three, it becomes a nuisance to knife him three times. So then you would just buy the M14, and I'll show you what to do then. I usually don't buy Quick Revive, just because, I don't know. I feel like Solo is already cheap as it is, just because you can revive yourself with it. But I don't know. I just... Sometimes don't buy it, because I want to see how far I can go without using it. Which is only like 35, because I make mistakes a lot. Get some ammo before the bloodshed can continue. But, yeah, oh yeah. Now we buy the M14. This is gonna and um, just a, t a trick to remember how many shots you shoot at them. Um, shoot them the number of rounds minus one. So one, two, and then knife. One, two, knife. And if there's a big group of them and you're about to get trapped, do not think you always have to knife them. Just shoot them and get them out of the way. Ooh. Oh, God. Oh, wow. That was bad. Wow. Came from up there. See what I mean by mistakes? I think it's best to just stand by that door right there. I know. You need me. No yeah, I'm not going to buy Quick Revive. We'll just see how far I can go. It's kind of a waste of 500 points, but whatever. No biggie. Oh, I hate this. I hate losing zombies to this damn thing. But yeah. We will not stay past round four in here. I would not recommend staying any longer than round five in here. You will get trapped pretty badly with these weapons. They're not very good. I mean, if you wanted to see how long you could go, just the Olympia and the M14, that might be interesting. Never tried that. So, one, two, three. Oop. I shot him in the leg. Let's see. One, one, two, three. There we go. That sucks. Why it does suck is because all these zombies died when I could have killed them, then gotten the nuke, and then I would have had all the points from the zombies and then 400 from the nuke. So if you do find a nuke, then do not get it immediately. See how many kills you can get before it starts to blink. So um, before you leave this room, you should always have around 5,000 points. That's usually best. At least 5,000 is good. I'm just going to kill this guy. Oh, well, I guess he wants to run. Come here. Here we go. Okay. So now we're going to open this door.